Hey guys, and welcome back to Onomusha. We last left off, we were playing as uh, Kitty here. And, well, you know, she's uh, definitely different to playing as Sam. Um, I mean, oh, hello. She's definitely not uh, very good at fighting the old enemies because there's kind of no point in her fighting the enemies. And uh, she can't collect souls to heal herself. So, yeah. And uh, instead of magic, she can throw uh, blades, which, or kunai, which is pretty cool. But they don't seem to actually do anything. Uh, I'm not sure what the point in them is um yeah but we did need a small cog and we found a small cog so happy days let's go see if we can put the small cog back where it needs to go okay we actually hit him with it that time but yeah okay pointless absolutely pointless uh oh god yeah we're not we're not fighting these guys <sighs> right so now where was that small cog needed uh, I can't actually remember I think it was in here somewhere uh, yeah through that room maybe let's drop a save because we're gonna save every time we go past one of these um, I do like that, like, comical ninja run that they all seem to do. That Naruto run, as I call it. Yeah, and I think loads of people call it that. Uh, it It's very hard to take seriously. Right, let's use the wooden gear. Now, what? Oh, there's another... No? No, 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 that's good. Okay, I thought there was going to be another gear missing then. I was like, God damn it. Right, hopefully we're not going to find too many enemies around here. Ah, we've got a silver plate. So I guess we also need to find the gold plate. And we have another book. When the powers of the demons are restored, the ogre clan will gather in the chasm dimensions between times. It is their will. Deliberate. Their plan. Alright, cool, we got that. Uh, this looks very expensive. Yes, it does. Everywhere here looks expensive. Is there any of that um, stuff? Oh, yeah, I guess there is. It makes me wonder how much of this stuff is kind of dotted around. I'm guessing we've probably missed quite a lot of it. But I, I don't know what we actually need it for. Uh, never mind. So, we've got... Right, we've got one... Okay. So if we go all the way back, there's another, there's a blue door there. But... Is that a... Blue door? How much of that stuff do we actually have now? Four. A small unusual stone that glows in the presence of a certain item. What does that mean? <laughs> it's like, okay, a certain item. What kind of certain item? Alright, anyway. Let's go. Save scum away. Uh yeah, definitely want to play the uh, Xbox version of this game because it's quite different from what. I, well, I mean, it's the same game, but uh, on the original Xbox, it's called Gemma. Uh, yeah, Gemma Onamusha, and it has extra enemies, extra weapons, extra areas. Uh, so sounds quite interesting I think it's also got extra bosses correct me if I'm wrong not 100% oh god 
Yeah. We can't go through there. So, there's got to be... If I was... And there's a new um, technique with absorbing souls on it as well. There's like a, a tug of war kind of mechanic, which to me sounded pretty shit. But apparently, um, the jury says it's it's quite a fun little mechanic. Uh, so we've got the silver thing, silver plate. But is that half of it or something? Hmm. How do you think we're supposed to be going this way? Yeah, not sure I'm going to effectively be able to fight that big red ninja guy. Uh, and I don't want to keep using all of my health items. Because I'm, I mean, I don't know how often we actually play as Curie. But I'm hoping it's not that much. Because she's a fine character, but oh god, he's here. Oh, hey. Definitely not fighting two of those guys. Uh, there's no goodies here. This is gonna suck. Right, so two of those. Oh, hello. Did we go down the well? I don't think we have been down the well. Right, let's go down. Oh, hello. He won't speak to you. Two to tango. What is that? Uh, what is that? Two to tango. Speak to the... Speak to the first and second old mothman. Right. But who is that dude though? Not sure why these times are totally out of whack. Uh, 1.18 p.m. It's not 1.18 p.m. <laughs> it's uh, 20 past 9, but sure, unless that's the server time, maybe. Uh, okay. Alright, well, I mean, I don't know what Mothman is, or what he does, but... Uh, Alright. I really kind of thought I was onto something then. Uh, can you actually throw at him? Hey, uh, really? Oh, you fucking suck with that thing. Right. There we go. Oh, man. It takes like five. Uh... Okay, so that's the underground. Right, there's another... Wait, we've been there, though. So where haven't we been? We can't go through there. Can't be removed. So we've got the Mole Man. Right, let's kill this guy, if we can. And we're just going to have to explore, I guess. Oh, hang on. I reckon I know where it is. There was a box, wasn't there? A riddle box. Uh, I'm guessing we need to solve that riddle box. Yeah, in fact, oh, that, that was, that was really lame. 
just instantly as the camera changes angle, we die. Nice game. Uh, okay, so where was that? There was a riddle box, wasn't there? Where was that? Uh, I think it was in the other save room. Wasn't it? Ah, uh, bloody hate this area. I mean, I could use some health, I know that, but I don't know how rare this stuff is going to be. Fuck off, pal. Right, there it is. I'm guessing what we need is is got to be in here. Name the mysterious location where the ogres gather. Uh Oh, we've got all of this now. When the powers of the demons are restored, the ogre clan will gather in the chasm of dimensions. So, the chasm of dimensions. Uh So, A, upside down E, and a steering wheel. That. Chasm of, then you need a window, and, okay. Uh, uh, there's that one. Okay. Oh, no. It's just a, a magic jewel. Uh, I mean, that's cool too, but... Uh, okay. Where is... No, nothing, so, all right. Hmm. So, according to this, where have we not been? We can't go into the blue room. We can't go into the red room. But... And that's all there is. So we've obviously missed something somewhere. Okay. Sure, I guess. Well. Let's save it and continue the hunt. I don't think there's anything out here. Doesn't look like it. So I'm guessing somewhere... Uh, it doesn't look like there's much out here. I mean, really? Like, are you sure there's nothing down here? Because that seems bizarre. That we can go talk to this weird dude, but... That's it? Really? No gold thingy-majig? Hmm. Seems a bit sus to me. Alright, well let's get rid of you again. There we go. So... Yeah, we know we can't do anything with that. I mean, the fluoride there, I guess. Which, uh, cool, I suppose. Uh, oh, hey, friend. Damn, there's so many of these fucking mutant bastards. And we're... Uh, oh, God. Right, I'm going to look for this thing off camera. Because I'm pretty sure it's going to be somewhere really fucking obvious. But... We've obviously, uh, we've missed it somewhere. Okay, so from what I can understand, somehow, 
we can manipulate this. I actually had to look it up. But I've no idea how we actually activate this thing. Uh, I did find another fluoride or fluorite, whatever it's called. Oh, God damn it! We're going to die. Oh, OK. So you go there, a pool tab. And that opens the door. OK, then. Cool, I guess. Right. There's the gold thingy. Yeah, that actually took me um, quite a while to find. And even then, uh, I had to look it up. So I did use another medicine, but we've got loads of herbs. And as I was running around searching, I found another fluoride. It was hidden uh, in a rock. So those things are... Ooh. Those things are kind of everywhere. Yeah, I th I tried... I mean, it looks obvious that you can manipulate this thing. But your actual footing for where you need to stand to activate it is really strange. Um, are these... Oh, okay. Well, that turns those off, which is cool. Yeah, I've killed loads of enemies here as well. Um, just experimenting she is a badass when it comes to dodging her dodging is so much better than um samonosuke's uh, she can literally just glide and fly around enemies which is fantastic and i did not know that so yeah i mean it kind of looks similar when you're just doing it here but when there's actually enemies there's like some really cool context sensitive flips and maneuvers she does actually around enemies, which is pretty sweet. Um, okay. Not super happy that we've wasted loads of health and stuff, but I, I guess the grand scheme of things, it doesn't really matter too much. Now, where are we going? Through here, apparently. I'm hoping this section's going to be over soon because, ah. Oh, Shit. There we go. No, 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 no. Bamboozled. What's that achievement about? Uh Bamboozled. Cut down bamboo in the bamboo forest. Ah. I didn't, but okay. All right, I'm happy with that. If you're happy with that, uh, did we save it? I can't remember if we saved it. We're gonna save it again. Not sure if um, there are, uh, you know, if there's like an end of game rank like there is in Resident Evil. If so, we're probably gonna get like the worst possible rank and I'm okay with that for now right there we go gold plate ah oh, please can I have Samonoski back please I'm hoping we oh dear I'm hoping we don't have to play as her again not that I have anything against her I mean she's a pretty cool character actually but Oh, shit. Oh. oh. Yeah. Well, uh, a good thing we saved the game, right? Don't step in the fire, kids. Don't, uh... Don't step in the fire. Okay. Right, let's get out of here. Let's try that again. Once more feeling. Why is everywhere on fire? I mean, honestly. I'm kind of looking forward to um, seeing what that automatic, like, soul absorber thing is. Is that, like, a single-use item? And I wish when you blocked, it's so weird, because you've got this, like, dodge thing, and then you've got this block thing, but it's different. I kind of wish they rolled that into one. Would that have been cheating? 
Oh. Right, so we can't cut that stuff. Okay. That's cool. Oh, hey friend. Kind of don't want to fight you. If I can help it. Yeah, if you could actually hit them. Kiri, thank you. Tank controls around the fire. Wow, we have like no health at all. Ah, oh, dude. Really, dude? You... Don't piss this woman off. Alright. So, what have we got here? Of demons may the one. Cool. I understand that perfectly. Uh, no. There's got to be more than that in here. No way. Oh, yeah. There's another door. Cool. I was about to call... Uh, large amounts of steaming bullshit there. I mean, more kunai. Cool, I guess. I guess we should keep looking for that fluorite. Oh! <laughs> there we go. I don't know how much of that stuff is. Uh, there is in the game. Trick. And I don't know what the hell we use it for. Uh Ah, oh, we failed. Um Right. Ooh. Give it one of them. So we need one and five. Two moves left. Ah, there we go. Cool. Uh, sacred knife. Wish I had had this sooner. Uh, another achievement. Wow, these achievements are dropping like nah. Uh, Dropping like flies, I should say. Okay, the sacred knife. Special knife. This has the power to banish demons. Okay, so we have a more powerful knife. Right, any more of that fluorite around? Yeah, I mean, I'm guessing uh, we use it to make powerful weapon or something later on. I don't know. I was wondering if it was like treasure. Ah, I guess we can cut our way through this lot down here. Yeah. I'm wondering if we can use it like treasure in Resident Evil 4, for instance. Still don't get or have the ability to absorb souls. Oh. I'm just going to call that stuff fluoride, because that's what my dyslexia is telling me to call it, so... From now on, we're looking for fluoride. I mean, how? I guess she needs to keep her teeth good, right? Ooh. You. <gasps> Wait a moment. I will help you out. You are Kaede. Sanosuke once wrote to me that he journeys with a female ninja, Kaede. So, you are... If only I could leave the castle and see the world with Sanosuke. Princess Yuki! Ah! I envy you. You can go. The hell was that? Forget about me. Escape from this castle with Semenosuke. Do not give up, Your Highness. I will save you. No, you won't. <gasps> what? 
Um, oh, hello. What the cheese and biscuits is that? I'm guessing we're going to need some more health. Just use a herb, I suppose. Holy shit. He's got, like, active camouflage. Really bloody good thing we got this new blade. Yeah, really happy we got this new blade. Come on, you little bitch. Where are you? Where are you? There you are, huh? Yeah, nice try. Ah, we're gonna die. Yep, we're gonna die. Oh, this is gonna... This is gonna be rough, isn't it? This is gonna be really rough. Fighting this guy. Oh, that's an unskippable cutscene as well. Oh, no. Oh. Laziest game design possible. Unskippable cutscenes. So, yeah, I need to do that all again. Okay. Right, let's try that one again, shall we? Right, so we can block that, I think. And then we can do some damage to the bastard. Come on, you little bastard. Oh, hello. I mean, he's got some moves. I'll give him that. He's definitely a quick git. That's okay. We can handle a quick git or two. There we are. What do you think of that, mister? Ooh. Luckily, it doesn't seem to matter what way you're blocking. It's effective. Which is really nice. Although I never expected to fight enemies of active camouflage here. But then, you know, they are demons. So I guess that makes sense. Does it? Yep, even that's blockable. Good to know. Okay. So, looks like we can block all of this guy's attacks. At least so far. Wait for him to move. And then counterattack. Nice. Ooh. What's that on the side of her head? Nah, I think it's some kind of headdress. Have to tell him. <laughs> yeah. Uh oh, thank God. I like Kiri. Or Kira Day or Kere or Kick My Ass A. Eh? Whatever the hell you say her name. But I want my boy back. Summon Oski. Let's go, buddy. Right, I, is there any, like, fluoride around here? Where the hell are we? We look like we're... Oh, save point there, which is really fucking convenient. Looks like we're in the devil's asshole right about now. That's not a good place to be. I assume. Unless you're into that sort of thing, which I don't judge. Come on. Ah. <sighs> So close and yet so far. Right, um, definitely want to do up some of these if we can. But I don't think we're going to be able to just yet. Um, okay, right. Well, I'm going to save the game then. Um, I guess we're back to Samonosuke. Oh. We also had a magic jewel and a soul absorber. Use. I'm going to read up on that before I use it. Because I don't know if that's like a one-use thing or what. Right, well, let's enhance our magic anyway. Right, okay, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Ah, now we have our boy back. I am glad. <sighs> Although, that new weapon that we got for Kirire... I don't know. I'm just going to call her Kaz. Yeah, that'd do. Um, or Ninja Girl. That also works. Um, she actually started to kick an ass or two, which is nice. I mean, I appreciate she's very uh, under-equipped for this encounter, as is everybody apart from Sam, because, you know, he's the 
chosen favourite, obviously. Uh, but yeah, with that new blade, she really did uh, start kicking an ass or two. Uh, she did do more damage with that weapon as well. Uh, if you remember, her original knife was not doing much damage. In fact, it was taking an embarrassingly long amount of time to kill anything. But that new blade was killing enemies pretty quickly. So, ha, huh, props to her, I guess. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time. Thank you.